Hi friends, in this session we will understand the concept of insulation resistance. Uh, basically, insulation resistance uh, is not uh, sum up as a single resistance uh, in the insulation. But uh, we can represent insulation resistance uh, as lot of parallel resistances which are connected in um, lot of resistances which are connected in parallel. So you can see this uh, diagram. Uh, the red color is a conductor, black is the insulation, and light blue is basically the insulation resistance, which is connected. Uh, and distributed in in a parallel connection so it means the resistance for example the formula of parallel connection of resistance is you have to divide reciprocal of uh, each resistances and sum up and then you have to uh, it will be equal to reciprocal of the total resistance so we all know that uh, resistances uh, are basically decreasing in parallel if you keep on adding the resistance in parallel the total resistance will keep on decreasing uh, that's why and the insulation resistance of a cable or of any any equipment when you increase the length of the insulation the value of insulation will be keep on decreasing for example if you are getting a, you are testing an insulation resistance of cable of 100 meter and if you are testing an insulation resistance of, of uh, 500 meter or 1 kilometer the insulation resistance of the longer or lengthier cables will be less based on this so it's not uh, uh, insulation resistance is not only depending upon the material type but it's also we can see by use, uh, understanding the equivalent circuit it's also depending the length so insulation resistance is distributed just like uh, connecting parallel uh, resistances in parallel so more the length of cable more resistances in parallel hence insulation resistance decreases as length of cable so now you can uh, imagine uh, the insulation resistance of any electrical equipment or cable and you can analyze yourself. Thank you very much.